Seasonal Sweetness is an event that appears as a Valentine's Day celebration event, and the main goal of players in this event is to achieve the highest honor ranking, because the rewards given are very good, namely permanent Dreamheart City skins for the 10 players with the highest honor ranking. Please remember that this event lasts for 7 days, so players must use strategy and maximize their efforts in order to reach the top rank. Therefore, I provide several important tips that will enable you to reach the highest rank in the Seasonal Sweetness event. The first tip, try as hard as possible to collect as much romantic finery as possible. This tip is important for you to know, because in the Frost Bloom menu, you need as much romantic finery as possible to increase your honor level as high as possible. Therefore, the best way to get romantic finery is to buy it, or try your best so that you can complete every task in King of the Roses, Timeless Love, and Sweet Trails. Apart from this, there is no other way for you to get romantic finery. If you choose the buying method, then I'm sure that you will have an easier and faster chance of getting the highest honor rank, but even that is likely to be successful if you are willing to make repeated purchases and spend large amounts of your money, which I think is an unwise choice to make. And after reviewing and recalculating, the best place for players who want to get large amounts of romantic finery is through the Sweet Trails event. I say this based on the data I calculated. If the player completes the task in King of the Roses, the player can only get 170 romantic finery per day. If players complete tasks in Timeless Love, then players can only get 600 romantic finery after completing all tasks and get rewards in Timeless Love. This means that if players complete all tasks every day in the King of the Roses and Timeless Love events, then players can only get an estimated total of 1800 romantic finery. However, if you compare it with the Sweet Trails event, you can get more than 1000 romantic fineries every day. If you add up the total for 7 days of the event, you can get at least 7000 romantic finery. This amount even beats the amount that King of the Roses and Timeless Love can give. You could say, by maximizing your efforts in completing every task available from every event, especially the Sweet Trails event, I can guarantee that you will have a better chance of reaching the top 10 honors ranking. Second tip, buy the right package. Maybe many players think that buying the Valentine's Day package is the best option to get romantic finery. But actually that was the wrong choice. Instead of buying the Valentine's Day package, why don't you buy the Ultra Value Monthly Card Package, because in this package there is an auto hunting feature, which you can use to maximize romantic finery income at the Sweet Trails event, besides you get chief stamina every day, you also you can easily collect 700 romantic finery every day, compared to the Valentine's package which only gives 100 romantic finery for each purchase. So if you do the calculations, buying an ultra value monthly card is better than buying a Valentine's Day pack, because apart from saving money, you can also get more romantic finery every day during the event. The third and final tip is, don't be half-hearted when using romantic finery. You should know that using romantic finery in small amounts over and over again will be detrimental to you, because it can directly reduce the chances of the potential multiplier bonus that you should be able to get. Therefore, I suggest that you only use romantic finery before the seasonal sweetness ends, why? This is because, spending large amounts of romantic finery at one time can trigger your score multiplier bonus more often, and allow you to achieve the highest honor score. Believe it or not, you can try and see for yourself. So those are the three main tips you need to know to get the highest rank in the Seasonal Sweetness event. I don't think you need to understand the basic guidelines for this event, because basically this event is very similar to the Easter Egg, Halloween, Thanksgiving, and Christmas events that appeared several months ago. Therefore the important tip for you to know is how to maximize score of your honor ranking by applying some of the tips I explained earlier, and if you have questions or additional explanations regarding the previous tips, feel free to submit them in the comment section. And we'll meet again in the next Wideout Survival video, bye.